the Dr. Power 2 is sim simple. Uh, basically, you, uh, right now I have the power supply outside of the computer. just makes wiring a little easier. But what we do is we have our power supply in the off position and plugged in. Um, and then we have the Dr. Power 2. Uh, the 24 pin is connected at the bottom here. We have our PCIe connected. This is the 8 pin connector, Molex connector, and then our 4 pin CPU connector connected. And then what we do is we turn our power supply on, which will boot up the Dr. Power. You'll see the blue LED screen light up. And then we just hit the button on the side to start the check. All right, and once we hit the check button and turn it on, it'll give us our values. Right now we are reading off the 24 pin connector here. If we keep hitting along the buttons, this is the PCI rail, the CPU rail, and then we got the Molex rail. And that is the Dr. Power 2. It's pretty simple to use, but it does require that you use all of your power supply connections. So this will, this can't be run in real time as the computer is running under, say, different load situations to try and diagnose if you have fluctuating rails. This is more of kind of like a first line of defense. If you think your power supply is failing, you can grab one of these, pop it in, and you're good to go.